and I welcome you back to the Debrinic Channel and today we are talking about the Three Gorges Dam. We're going to have the water levels, we're going to have the weather forecast, and we're going to have some other news as well. So please like and subscribe, stick around, and we'll be right back. And I welcome you back to the Debrinic channel. And before we get over to the Three Gorges Dam, I just want to stop and say that I am getting ready to launch my new merchandise store. That you guys will be able to purchase shirts, hoodies, coffee cups, stickers, anything that you can think of. Plus, you'll get 15% off. I mean, that is fantastic. 15% off within the next 10 days if you purchase. So I will leave the link until the shelf gets actually up on YouTube and you can check that out below. So anything will help the Debrinic channel out. I'm in need of a new computer as this thing's dated and I need to get a new one. So if you guys would be so helpful, that would be great. If not, no worries. Without further ado, let's roll right over to windy.com and start checking out the weather in China for the Yangtze River system. As we roll over to windy.com, and look at this right here. This is a Three Gorges Dam right here. This is a windy.com. In the next three days, we're looking at 0.44 inches, half inch, not a whole lot. Down here by Yoyang, they're going to get 1.68. This area here has just been getting bombarded with rain after rain. Unlike last year, the rains were up here more, which means that the Three Gorges Dam's not going to get as much precipitation into the reservoir as it would if it was over here more. This is going to go more towards Wuhan, which Wuhan might get flooded. It's just hard to say. They got 2.5 inches down here. And then we're going to go to the next five and see what that does. 3.7. Like I said, this is a lot of rain down here. They're getting almost four inches down here. That's an extreme amount of rain. Up here, they're getting a modest 6.3. We go up a little bit higher, 1.3. 7, Yaan, 2.33, Dazu, 1.52. So uh, they're going to get quite a bit of rain, but not not near as much as down here. So we go to the next 10 and see if anything's changed, and it does. So they're going to get three inches of rain over the next 10 days. And most of it's going to come within the 5 to 10 day period. So that's a good guess. So it's hard to say. But Dazu, 2.73. That's 3 inches of rain. And then you got more down here. Some of this down here can make it to the reservoir itself at 3.78, 3.74. A wide swath of 3. That come up here, 3.39. That's quite a bit. That's over 3 inches of rain. Then you got a solid 2. And over here is kind of in between. Not quite an inch. And then right over here, it creeps in. Now there's mountains up here. And last summer, that's where the majority of this hit. And you notice that the majority of this here is within the two inch rain. Now, out of curiosity, I want to see if this is snow that's coming here. This is going to get bombarded with anywhere between 17 to 19 and to 20 inches of snow. Now let's go check out the snow depth and see if anything's changed with that. So they don't have a big snow depth here. And it's crazy that they're getting snow this late. But this is the mountains. But 12 inches... 14 inches and you got a little bit there so all this snow will be melting within the next month or two but then you get this big new snow coming in and it's going to be intense and a lot more so another foot that's not good news because eventually what happens is this will turn into a rain situation instead of snow and it'll melt this snow off it will all go over here to the three gorges reservoir so we'll have to be watching that to see if this comes to pass and if it does it's not going to bold well but i noticed that they're starting to drop the lake level a little bit more and we'll go check that out here in a second as we roll over to the three gorges dam water level you can clearly see that it was 163.14 and that's 8200 out and it doesn't show the in as usually it does most days it does some days it don't today it don't now 163 is quite a ways from the top of 175 but it's not down to the 145 that they claim they're going to get it now i just read a news article just a few minutes ago that said that they will have it down to 145 by flood season 
but we are getting really close to flood season as you have a whole big snowpack that's going to be in the mountains just to the west of the Three Gorges Reservoir and therefore eventually it is going to hit the Three Gorges Reservoir and then down to Wuhan and now furthermore if they start to drop this at 163.14 and they got to get it down what is that almost 20 meters by the time flood season hits and then you also have Wuhan and downstream on the Yangtze River getting nailed with gobs and gobs of rain as, as I just showed over at windy.com that they are the Three Gorges is going to get spared with some of this but at the same time there's also building a heavier snowpack within the next 10 days and this is not good news at all ladies and gentlemen we'll have to wait and watch and see as we always do and like I pointed out before are these really accurate numbers once again I can't find a lot of articles that are going on so so in closing because there's very little articles on the Three Gorges Dam today. Old news is about all I can find. The news is bleak. There's not a whole lot. The only thing I told you about the other news was the article I read about them trying to get it down to 145 before flood stage. And let me just elaborate on that for a little bit. If they decide to drop that pretty quick, because, you know, it's already April and you know may starts the flood season so when are they gonna drop it and how quick are they gonna drop it and with all this rain to the south of the three gorges reservoir which is going to go ultimately to the yangtze river and it's going to cause major problems in the yangtze river that is problematic for like wuhan and further to the east of the three gorges reservoir i want to thank each and every one of you guys for stopping by i appreciate each and every one of you and we will see you on the next one god bless and peace